batteries are kind of new to kayaks. Like this is a, an ongoing evolving process. And it seems like there's some disconnect in far, as far as how batteries are measured, uh, how capacity works, how amperages and voltages. And I mean, I've seen even some of the biggest names in the industry saying things that just aren't correct. Um, so basically the main thing I wanna talk about is just comparison of batteries. And I think the biggest misconception I see is that higher voltage batteries equal bigger batteries. And that's just not the case at all. Um, so the first thing you realize is if you have, let's say a 12 volt battery, that's 100 amp hours, that's 1200 watt hours. So when you think about, okay, so if in a pipe it's pressure and volume, amp hours then um, is basically the size of the water tank, okay? So that's how much water is in the tank. And then again, the voltage is how much pressure is there behind that water that's in the tank. And then you should always think about batteries, not in voltages or amp hours, but in watt hours. So watt hours are just the volts times the amps gives you the watt hours, okay? So if you have this battery, let's say it's 12 volt, 100 amp hour, that gives you 1200 watt hours. Just, it's 12 times 100, real easy, right? So what that means is that if you have a motor that is drawing 1200 watts, you can push 1200 watts for one hour, right? Um, so like some of the other motors out there are between like 11 and 1300 watts. So on a standard 12 volt, 100 amp hour battery, that would give you roughly one hour at 100% output, roughly speaking. 